I figured that Game of Thrones would be taking a number of nominations for Emmy. Well, I figured season eight of Game of Thrones would be taking several Emmy nominations. Little did I know just about how many they would take. What's up, everybody? A uh, proper Jeremy here, and today I'm just going to go over uh, this just ridiculous story that, oh my gosh, they, it, they broke the record for the most nominations in a single season. That is just insane to me. Uh, wow, with 32, 32 Emmy nominations, and I love how it says, even for writing. Uh, wow, this is just... This is incredible. Um, by the way, uh, if you're new here, uh, please hit the subscribe button. If you like this video, hit that like button. And uh, if you enjoy my work and you feel that you want to donate to the channel, my PayPal is in the link in the description down below. Anyways, let's get uh, to all of these nominations. Uh, all, <laughs> I'm not going to go through all 32. Most of them are, are for acting, like the multiple, uh, the multiple entries uh, come from... Uh, the best supporting, the outstanding supporting actors. Uh, so uh, Jamie, Tyrion, and uh, Theon uh, all did a great job. Gwendolyn Christie, Sophie Turner, uh, Lena Headey, and uh, Maisie Williams. Yeah, absolutely. They uh, definitely deserve it. And I'm not going to really talk too much about that because I think that they did a fantastic job with the material that they were given and did the best that they could. <laughs> uh, rest their soul. Oh, wow. Just... And uh, so we're going to go and uh, look through some of the more questionable nominations. Um, cinematography of The Iron Throne, um, the last one, you know what, I, I, that's fine, I, I guess. I, I didn't have an issue with that, especially with the one shot with uh, Amelia Clark with the wings in the back. That was probably uh, the only real highlight of that episode, in my opinion. Oh, jeez. But let's go to, uh, okay, single uh, single camera picture editing. Uh, so with this, um, The Long Night, uh, you know what? The Long Night's the one I have a big problem with. And they have three entries out of, out of six. They have half of the entries in this. That's just insane. Wow. Um, the Long Night, yeah. You, you know what? Uh, no, that's probably the least deserving. Uh, you can't see the battle, all the hard work and effort that the crew had put into. All a big waste of time because we can't see any of their wonderful work that they. I'm sure that they've created. Um, yeah, so uh, no to that. I, if that's the one that gets it, just I, I can't. No. Um, Outstanding directing. Oh, this should be good. Uh, <laughs> the Long Night. Uh, again, no, absolutely not. Can't see the damn thing. The Iron Throne. Um, no, 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 no. Uh, and The Last of the Starks. Ah, yeah, yeah, the Starbucks. Last of the Starbucks. Yeah, no. Uh, I, that is probably the most inexcusable uh, <laughs> fluke. God, one of two. And... Yeah, and the Iron Throne, you had that water bottle. Yeah, just great. Yeah, great job. Great job with your impeccable details. No, um, I, 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 you know what? I don't think any of these deserve that. These are like the worst episodes. The worst, jeez. And then, uh, of course, you know, for the best writing is uh, the wonderful conclusion, uh, Brand the Broken, the Iron Throne. Uh, this, uh, that's just, wow. And then, of course, uh, outstanding drama series, Game of Thrones. Yeah, we, we knew that was going to get... I, I knew that was going to get nominated, but... Um, wow. I mean, to break the record... It, you know, it's just a, it's just so telling just where people are at. Uh, you know, there's just a huge disconnect between the audience and the award shows. This seems like, you know, the token drama series that's just going to sweep the awards, and I don't think it's deserving of that whatsoever. Um, you know, especially for the writing and the directing category specifically, um, which I knew some of them were going to get nominations uh, from the huge list of submissions that they had a couple of months ago, and I did a video on that. The link uh, will also be in the description or it'll be in the comments pinned. I'm not sure which one yet. But yeah, I, this is uh, this is just crazy. Um, the amount of uh, 
hard work that everyone put into it was all to me, you know, you had two years to make a great season eight and you messed up. You, you screwed it. You fumbled the ball. You, you let it. You, you're like in the outfield and you let the grounder go through your legs, you, you know, and you let the other team score a home run. You, you messed up. You messed up. And, you know, it's fine if you liked the uh, finale if you liked the game of thrones season eight uh series the series finale yeah that's totally fine um i don't agree a lot of people don't agree it's probably one of the few things that actually brought people together <laughs> and this is just this is just the gift that keeps on giving this complete joke of a, a series now especially just yeah well more on this when the Emmys actually do arrive and we get to complain about what awards they win, what awards they didn't win, which I will not be complaining about really. <laughs> but um, I don't know. I don't know, guys. I, I just don't think that this... Uh, this I, what, what is it with Hollywood just giving out incentives for terrible work? It just... It blows my mind. It just absolutely blows my mind. But uh, I would like I would like to get to know your thoughts. What do you think of all this? Do you think Game of Thrones deserves all of these nominations? Uh, which ones do you think they do deserve? Which ones do you think they don't? Let me know in the comment section down below. Uh, and once again, if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. And if you like what I said, uh, by all means, hit that like button. But if you didn't like it, that's okay. You can hit the dislike button because my feelings will not be hurt. Anyways, guys, thank you all so much and have a great day.